Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'll be showing you how to make Japanese iced coffee. If you ever had cold brew, prepare to have your minds blown. Firstly, you'll want to adjust your grind setting three to four clicks finer than you normally would for when doing pour overs. Since I'm only making this for myself today, the recipe I'll be using is going to need 15 grams of coffee and about 150 grams of water. Because this is iced coffee, the other portion of the water is coming from, you've guessed it, melted ice. You'll still want to wet the filter to get rid of that paper taste, but use cold water or do it over the sink so you won't heat up the decanter. I'm using the cold water here just because I'm too lazy to go over to the sink. Add about 75 grams of ice. Begin pouring about 30 grams of water and let it bloom for 30 seconds. Pro tip, give it a stir to saturate all the grounds. And now we wait. Continue pouring until it reaches 90 grams and let it sit for another 30 seconds. That's the name of the game, just patiently waiting. Since the water is still kinda hot, the extra ice will dilute the coffee some more. Once the timer hits a minute, pour the rest of the water till it reaches 150 grams. An extra stir never hurt nobody. Go ahead, you deserve it. Can you guess what the next steps are? That's right, more waiting. If you gave this a try, let me know in the comments. When the water has gone through, swirl the coffee until the remaining ice melts. And that's how you make a nice cold drink to be enjoyed during the summer, even though it's practically over now. But who says you can only drink this during the summer? You're an adult, you can do whatever you want. Hope you liked this video. If you did, consider subscribing. It's free and you can unsubscribe later. And check out my other videos and follow me on my socials. Cheers.